Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For the cheapest and fastest coins anywhere, make sure to check out MMOEXP.com and use code ZERK for 5% off your order. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. Those of you guys that don't know, National Hispanic Heritage Month is actually September 15th through October 15th, and it looks like EA may actually have a promo for that. Now, I do want to give a shout out to Dominic Atello from being a part of the Nota Gang. If you guys want a chance to shout out the next video, drop a like in the vid, make sure you guys are subs to the channel, turn the notification bell on, and comment down below, Nota Gang. Also guys, don't forget to enter the giveaway I'm currently running for two $50 gift cards. All you guys got to do, retweet the tweet, which will be at the top of the comment section. Follow myself and comment down below, Zerk look on that. I am picking winners on Monday. And I also want to say shout out to all you guys that checked out Underdog Fantasy last night for Thursday Night Football. If you guys copy my picks, maybe copy my dad to halftime picks as well yes there are now second half picks for you guys to make well combined between my dad and i we had 210 dollars in w's it definitely was a pretty decent night if alan robinson would have actually you know got the ball probably would have been an amazing night and if gabriel davis got one more catch it would have been pretty crazy too but can't be mad at it definitely was pretty solid don't miss out though on this weekend's nfl football games if you guys want to check out underdog fantasy you can use code zerk to match first deposit up to hundred dollars and follow me over on twitter for my picks and speaking of twitter that is where we're going to start off this video thanks to mutt leaks so mutt leaks a couple of days ago guys actually tweeted out these pack animations now you guys can see this animation right here this one is actually called guatemala okay and it says nhhm now nhhm as i already told you guys is national hispanic heritage month which again is from september 15th to october 15th and if we scroll down their feed you guys can see we have the guatemala reveal right here right animation looks pretty cool we also have the mexico one reveal which you'll notice that the animation is the exact same we have the mexico two reveal again the animation is the exact same and finally we have the honduras reveal which the animation is the exact same However, there is actually something different in between all of these, and that is the sound. So all of them, yes, these are different animations. They all look the same, but they have different, like, sounds when you open up the packs. But we do know that all of these have different sounds, so they most certainly are different animations. And it looks like, when you take a look at the feed that they tweeted out, right? We have Honduras, we have Guatemala, and we also have two Mexicos. And as I told you guys, this promo, or at least uh, the Hispanic Heritage Month, goes from September 15th to October 15th. Now, next week, we already know we have Ultimate Kickoff Part 2 coming on Thursday. Which, on Thursday, that would be the 15th. So, will we see this promo actually release as soon as next Thursday with the start of the National Hispanic Heritage Month? I'm also going to talk to you guys about what I think this promo is going to be and some players that I think we potentially could see in this promo as well. But do you guys think it'll be dropping exactly on the 15th with Kickoff Part 2? Will I have, like, you know, two promos? Or will they do kickoff part two on Thursday, right? And then on Friday, maybe they'll just drop the National Hispanic Heritage Month promo there. I think that definitely could happen. Uh, the thing is, I don't know why we haven't seen a promo on Friday yet, right? It's a little bit weird. We're usually seeing promos on Fridays, but we just haven't been. So let me go ahead and show you guys what I think this promo could be based on what the Black History Month promo was the past couple of years. Now, for the past two years, guys, we have actually had a Black History Month promo, which a lot of things with these promos, like I think two years ago, when the promo came out, like it was pretty solid. You know, we got a couple free players, but last year, I felt like they took it a little bit extra step because we actually got a ton of free players that you could potentially earn. And to be honest, some of the cards were pretty solid. They weren't crazy, crazy good, but they definitely were pretty solid and some were just really interesting and kind of cool. So I think this could be a very interesting promo with the uh, NHHM promo. But with Lamar Jackson, you see right here, this promo came out February 8th last year. The Black History Month is back for month 22 and is meant to highlight current and former African-American players who have excelled on and off the field this year's program features six different 93 overalls with discounted built-in abilities that can be earned for free by completing challenges and missions the first three abilities for each player are locked and cannot be changed however the fourth slot gives you the choice between two different abilities or you can always leave that slot empty and save the ap 
So as you guys can see, we got Lamar Jackson, who had 95 speed, 94 throw power, 87 short, 90 medium, 89 deep. Like, this was really, really cool for people that maybe had, like, budget teams. You know, I felt like this was pretty awesome. Uh, Ladanian Tomlinson wasn't really a crazy card. Najee Harris wide receiver. This was one of those that I would say is, like, a fun card, to be honest. Uh, Quiddy Pay at right end had 91 speed, 93 block shit, 95 pound move. Derek Thomas, this in my opinion, was maybe the best one overall. Like, this was a legitimate outside linebacker that, like, could really start for your team. And then we had Kevin Byard as well. The way this promo worked, you guys can see we actually had solo challenges you had to do to earn the 88 overall and unlock the player missions needed to earn their 93 overall. So it was pretty much like this. There was nothing really in there uh, to spend money on. Like, I know a lot of people are kind of hoping that EA wouldn't make this, like, a money grab type of promo. I feel like it would probably be something similar to this now in terms of some players that we could potentially see in this promo though i have a couple of players that come to my mind now you guys can go down in the comment section and let me know what players do you think we could potentially see here but starting off ted hendrix now you guys may not know this and i'll be honest i didn't know this either until literally a couple minutes ago uh ted hendrix actually is guatemalan and i think this is definitely one we'll see to be honest because ea absolutely loves ted hendrix the past couple of years and to be honest i like the card too he's always really good six foot seven tends to have pretty good speed you can use him as like a pass rusher you can use him in coverage he's just like a really balanced card but last year they released a strong safety 10 Hendricks, and that card was incredible. So, I really, really hope that with this promo, that the Guatemalan one hopefully will have a strong safety Hendrix. Now, if he releases as a linebacker, cool. Uh, but if they made him a strong safety, I think that would be amazing. Especially if, as I said, if they do the promo like they did Black History Month the past couple of years, where they just kind of make it free players that you can get, and maybe interesting players like wide receiver Najee is just like a really cool card this would be an amazing card because everybody liked that strong safety Hendricks last year. And of course, Madden 20 is so old that I can't even bring up the card art here on Mutthead to showcase this for you guys. But the last time we actually had a Victor Cruz card, I believe was Madden 20. Uh, and he was a themed diamond back then. And I feel like Victor Cruz definitely makes a lot of sense to be a part of this promo as well. Uh, this card here was a 95 overall with 94 speed, 95 Excel. Uh, was pretty decent, but I feel like Victor Cruz cards, they're always really fun to use. And of course, as a Cowboys fan, how could I not include Antonio Romero in here, aka Tony Romo? Yeah, of course, I'm going to throw Tony Romo in here. I absolutely would love to see him. Uh, I feel like there are a lot of players that potentially could be in this promo. And if done correctly, I think this could be really cool. As you guys saw, there were four different ones that they actually had for animations with Honduras, with Guatemala, and then also with uh, two Mexico releases. So this could really be like a month-long promo if EA wants to do it that way which I think is possible. Uh, right now, you know, we don't really have a ton of content in the game. We have Legends on Saturdays, and then that's pretty much it. Uh, Team of the Week on Tuesday as well, I guess that is starting up now. But we don't have a Wednesday promo currently in the game. We don't have a Thursday promo currently in the game, aside from, like, new promos when they drop out. But we don't have something we consistently know is going to be there. So I think EA may be filling up a slot on Wednesday or Thursday or maybe even Friday uh, for the next four weeks. I think that's something they probably want to do. You guys let me know down below what you think about this promo and also what players you think we potentially could see. But I am pretty intrigued by this. I think this could be a very, very cool promo. And if you guys enjoyed this video, check out these.